Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. So if you are new to this channel or to this series, my name's Shelly, I'm a third grade teacher in Northern California, and this series is going to be another day in the life of a teacher. This is year two, and it starts today. Today is the first day of school. I am so excited to get this year going. It feels a lot different than last year. Last year was my first year teaching. Um, I'm not quite as nervous as I was last year. I feel like I have a little bit of a better grip on things, but um, I mean, there's always gonna be those little butterflies, you know? I'm just really excited to get started. So basically in this series, I'm going to vlog periodically throughout my weeks to give you a little glimpse of what it's like to be a teacher. So if you guys wanna follow along my teaching journey, whether you're a teacher or a lawyer or a mom or a kid, I would really appreciate having you. So go ahead and make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any videos. And if you wanna see what a first day of school is gonna look like, go ahead and keep on watching. All right, so school for us starts at 8.40. It is currently 7.15. I got here at about 6.45. I just like to have time in the morning to decompress, especially on the first day, make sure I have everything ready to go. Um, my classroom's not 100% ready, but that's okay. That's real life. Um, I am just kind of tying up a couple of loose ends, and then I'm gonna walk you through what we are going to be doing today. Okay, so I'm just about ready to go. I am not so much gonna talk about the room and um, things in the room because I did a whole um, other series on setting up my classroom. I'm also gonna be posting an in-depth room tour um, a little bit later on, so stay tuned for that. So I'm just gonna kind of walk you through how our day is gonna go. I will show you what their tables look like. So when the kids walk in, they're going to find their seats. Whoop, let me focus. At their tables, there is um, their name tag. Those are my Teachers Pay Teachers store. Uh, a caddy, which eventually are gonna go away because I hate caddies. In those are just um, crayons and uh, markers for their coloring. This is just going to go um, into their green folders. Um, so they're just gonna slide into this pocket. So I'm just gonna have them decorate their um, name cover when they first come in. And then on my smart board, it says welcome to third grade and then just directions. So they're gonna put their supplies under that window, um, their snacks and lunch in the bin, and then find your seat and get started. So, so that's what they're gonna do when they first walk in. And then this is what our day is going to look like. Now, not, now normally I'm not going to write out the schedule. I have these um, schedule cards, which are also in my Teachers Pay Teacher store if you're interested, but this is kind of what our day is gonna look like. We're gonna, uh, they're gonna arrive at 8.40. They're gonna work on their folder covers. And I just, I never do this, but, um, since it's my first day back and I don't know how to teach anymore, I have that there just for me. I'm going to show them a slideshow, an introduction of me. They get to ask me 21 questions. We're gonna go into our morning meeting and that whole routine. Then we're gonna take a school tour and talk about the playground rules and things like that. Then they're gonna work on an about me sheet, which I'll show you. Recess, then I'm gonna read first day jitters. It's a great first day story. I read it last year, highly recommend it. We're gonna do a little bit of a writing activity with that. And then we're gonna do a classroom scavenger hunt, which I will show you in a second. Talk about the lunch rules, go to lunch. They're gonna um, continue working on their about me. We're gonna talk about um, green folders, with basically our communication folders. We're gonna pack up and go home. Today is Thursday, so it is a short day. We have minimum days every Thursday, so we have um, collaboration at the end of the day. I'm not gonna lie, like as I'm watching the clock, I'm getting a little more nervous. As you can tell, I'm talking really fast. I'm like, I don't know, I, I literally feel like I don't know how to teach anymore. Does anyone else get like that on the first day? It's like, I know I did it all year last year, but all of a sudden I'm like, I don't know what to say, I'm gonna freeze. Um, I know I feel like once the kids come in, it'll just come naturally, like riding a bike. But my heart's like, ba-boom, ba-boom. I'm kind of freaking out a little bit, but that's okay. Um, so let me show you the activities that they're gonna be doing. So I'm gonna try this this year. I just have a basket that I'm gonna put all of the um, current day stuff in. I don't know why. I'm not obsessed with these bins anymore, whatever. So this is the um, All About Me sheet that they're gonna be working on. It's like a cute little emoji um, All About Me thing, favorites, something they did over summer, and then they can color it. Just a really low stress, low anxiety activity for them. I got this on Teachers Pay Teachers. Um, I will link it in the description. And then um, after they read, after we read First Day Jitters, this is just what a learning log looks like. If you've been to GLAD training, you know exactly what this is. If not, basically they're, we're gonna read the story. I'm gonna ask them one question about the text. So I'm just gonna ask them to describe the character. They can just draw her, honestly. And then um, some connection. So then I'm just gonna ask them, how did you feel on your first day? So that's that activity. And then this is the classroom scavenger hunt, which I didn't do last year and I'm excited for it this year. 
Um, so it says, safely walk around the room searching for each item. As they find the item, they're just gonna check it. I'm gonna tell them they can open things but they cannot touch. After they do the scavenger hunt, I'm gonna walk around the room and um, do a full tour. And then this is a class um, classmate scavenger hunt. I'm sure you've seen this before. Whoop, they just walk around and find people to fill in the squares. I don't know if we're gonna get to this today, but in case there's extra time. Whoop. So that's um, everything that they're gonna do today. Now, as far as teaching rules and procedures, um, last year, I pretty much spent the whole first day doing rules and procedures, and I could just see the kids like, so I'm doing it a little bit differently this year. I'm just gonna kind of roll it out as we need them. Um, I think the first day they're nervous and they haven't been doing school for literally three months. So to just sit there and bore them with routines and procedures on the first day, um, the whole day I think is a little much. Now, don't get me wrong, you need to set that in place like ASAP, um, but just talking at them about rules I don't know, it's just not my style. If that's what you do, good for you. Um, so I'm just gonna roll it out a little more naturally. Like when we need to line up, okay, let's practice, let's do that. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, I'm gonna head out there in about five minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and put you down. Next time I talk to you, I will have met all my kids and I will let you know how the beginning of our day goes. Bye, wish me luck. Woo! Okay, you guys, it's officially lunchtime. I didn't get the chance to chat at recess. Woo, I forgot. You need to be in like teacher shape. I'm not used to talking this much. I'm not used to standing this much. Um, but so far it's been a really good, I have such good kiddos. Um, you know, we're a little bit of a rambunctious bunch, but that's okay. We're not doing a ton of rules on the first day. Um, as they kind of, I think I mentioned this, as they come up, we talk about them. Um, however, it's funny to see like how they kind of forget certain things throughout the summer. Like, well, you can't just come up and talk to me because then I have 12 kids in line waiting to talk to me. Like, we need to raise a hand. So it's kind of fun. Um, but overall, it's been pretty fun. We had, so it, everything took longer than I thought, which I figured. Um, we, I showed them my slideshow, we did the 21 questions, which they love, and that was really fun. Um, we did our morning meeting, we took a tour around the school. Um, they started their About Me pages, the emoji ones I showed you that are really cute. We read First Aid Jitters. We didn't get to do the like reading, or the, writing afterwards because I just I felt them out and they just like were not having it so we just read the story and then um we did our classroom scavenger hunt which was awesome they found everything they were really good about like being safe in the classroom so that was nice um so now they're at lunch when they come back from lunch I think I'm gonna have them either finish their about me or do the classmate scavenger hunt um and then we pretty much go home because it's a short Thursday so that's where we're at. First day's going good. Other than the meme not being in shape, I'm surviving. Um, let me show you like the current state of my room. This is already getting messy. There's our scavenger hunt. This was our morning meeting. I kind of made this on the fly, totally forgot about it. So there's some evidence of work going on. That's their um, folder cover and their emoji thing. So I'm actually gonna stuff their folder covers. These are their folders. I'm gonna stuff them while they're at lunch. And uh, so far, so good. These are the supplies that I have gotten so far. I'm honestly like, was expecting more, but it is what it is. So I'm gonna go through those at the end of the day and figure out how I wanna organize those. But they're just living here for now and, and that's fine. But I haven't actually eaten yet. So I'm gonna go to the lunchroom and eat with my coworkers and then I'll probably check back in with you at the end of the day. I survived day one. I haven't been this tired in so long I am wiped I'm so tired um it was a really good day the first day is just always kind of a freaking whirlwind to be honest with you um I don't even remember what we did I'm gonna close these really quick so basically when they came back from lunch I just chatted all about our green folders which is all like parent communication folders our homework policy which pretty much there isn't any, um, I mean, not entirely true. I'll go into that later. But um, I chatted with them for a while. We talked about cleaning up the room and then we packed up and went home. And then, and then my principal, we usually have collaborations on Thursdays, but since the first day, we just met in a room. He gave us ice cream sandwiches and was like, enjoy your day. So now, as badly as I want to jet out of here and go take a nap, I'm gonna try and get ready for tomorrow. So Fridays are, kind of weird for me so okay 
I said to sit down so I can like chat with you guys. So um, on Fridays, I have two preps back to back. So I have music, which is new to my school and I'm so excited about it. And I have Spanish and they're back to back. So I'm not even kidding you on Fridays. We have the morning. I take my kids to recess at 1040. They're at recess from 1040 to 11. Then they go to Spanish, then they go to music, and then they go to lunch. So I do not see my kids from 1040 until 115. And at first I was like, that sucks because that's a huge chunk of your day. Um, and I really like Fridays in the classroom, but then the more I was talking to my teacher friends, they were like, dude, that's kind of awesome because you can get literally everything ready for the next week. And last year I had zero preps on Friday, so we're gonna see, that's tomorrow. So we're gonna see how that goes. Um, so tomorrow's going to fly by. I need to prep, like I said, some things for tomorrow. Um, we are going to play the Jenga uh, Get to Know You game, which I'll show you for. Or I'll show you in a minute. My brain is like, um, and we're gonna do more rules tomorrow because I said I wasn't gonna do rules today, and did they need it? Oh boy. Um, so we're really gonna kind of hammer down what our costume rules are. They come up with those um, together, and we're gonna power through to the end of the week. I, that's so funny, it's been two days, and I'm already like. <laughs> um, so I'm gonna put you guys down, I'm gonna prep some stuff for tomorrow, I'll show you what we're doing, and then I'm gonna wrap this vlog up, so I'll see you in a second. And just for the record, some of you asked me why I hate caddies, and this is exactly why. Like what, they just throw stuff in here, they don't put things back, like, I just, I just can't. This one's not so bad, but where are the markers? They had a whole pack of them in there. All right, so I'm gonna show you what we're gonna do tomorrow. So this is Get to Know You Jenga, and basically there's six colors, purple, blue, green, yellow, pink, red, and I got these, um, they're like mini Jengas from Dollar Tree, so they're literally a dollar each. And then I just colored um, the ends of the pieces, one of the six colors. So they're gonna play Jenga tomorrow, and if they pull, let's say, a purple one, they can ask their team any one of these questions, and then they answer it. So I think it'll be a really fun way. So I'm just gonna finish coloring these, and then I'm gonna get out of here. All right, guys, it is that time for me to go. I am ready to go home. I'm also ready to come back tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for following along. It's gonna be an awesome year, and I would love to have you on this journey. This is gonna be my second year teaching, and I'm going to vlog constantly throughout the year. So. If you want to follow along my journey, go ahead and hit the subscribe button below to see what teachers' lives are like, the good, the bad, and the ugly. And yeah, I would love to have you. So if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.